Hey guys, Thunder Snipe here, bringing you a new Ark Boat video. Uh, yes, I know it's been a long time since I said I'd start this series and get another video out. And I'm probably not going to make this video the way I said I would at the end of the last one. I think I'm just going to kind of wing it, because I kind of just woke up and felt like making something today. So, uh, But for this one, we're going to make the industrial boats, and we're actually going to do one and two. As you can see here, I have industrial boat two already made. Um, this is what both of them have pretty much the same outer shell. The only difference really comes down to how you make up the inside between the two of them. Uh, Industrial Point 2 has a bit more of a, uh, has a bit more of a house living style, you know, um, whereas the first one, uh, we made specifically for metal runs, uh, when we were living on the islands, uh, just over there in the distance. So, pretty much we're gonna start out with the standard three by three uh, raft and we'll go from there uh, and I'll pause the video but I'm pretty much gonna throw a little bit of a fast forward while some music plays for you guys like last time and I'll stop when I need to say something all right let's get started
Alright guys, so there you have it. There's the Industrial 1.0. Um, like I said, exact copy for the shell of the 2.0. Uh, here's the big difference is, like I said, this one's more for living. Um, it has half the number of furnaces, but you know you can fit a fabricator up here, um, a preserving bin in the corner, um, smithy bed, uh, just one, no, just uh, two, so half the mortar and pestles. But then you get a lot more storage with this one. Um, this one's a little bit more of like what I usually use if I'm making an early game industrial boat. Uh, this one over here was just, you know, we were kind of just to that point in the game where we're somewhat making metal structures, but we need metal a lot, you know, and we already had, a, you know, a bunch of other boats because like I've said in the past, boats are like my thing, you know, that's my favorite thing to do on Ark was make boats. And it's the whole point of this uh, series. So this one became the more practical one uh, in that situation, because it was just a very quick make. We can constantly have this stuff smelting. A uh, downside to it is it gets hot. Like, uh, didn't think that completely through. So while we were doing this, uh, we'd pretty much only be able to go to close by metal locations, which we lived by to begin with. Um, and we'd load them up and we wouldn't usually actually start the furnaces until we were at home and we'd have all these furnaces cooking uh, so when it came down to more of a normal one when I wasn't constantly just popping out boats because of living on the islands and you know I just wanted to make it a little bit more usable uh, that's when this design came through instead so uh, not a huge difference but uh, enough enough of a difference to make them separate boats uh, in practicality and what you're kind of wanting to use them for specifically. Um, the other feature that I'm going to show you here in a sec is that you can pretty much get your ank ankies and walk them up here. That's what the ramps are for. I'm pretty sure it was fairly easy to guess that, but for those of you who didn't, um, yeah. And then this slot right here, you can actually add, uh, you know, turret to X plants, whatever you really want to do. Um, I contemplated putting a roof slot here in this middle section and throwing a generator there. Um, there's enough room to do it, but if you don't, you know, it, it makes sense. You know, I'm somebody who doesn't like the ceiling straight over my head, so, yeah. But, uh, that's it. That's a pretty quick video for the ARC one today. This is a fairly standard, easy-going boat design. Um, it's not hard to make on official servers, that's all I make my boats on our official servers until I started the series on a custom server, just to make it faster for you guys. So yeah, uh, Industrial Boats 1 and 2. And the next boat I think we're going to try and do is I'm going to start the Valkyrie series because I have five Valkyrie boat designs. And at some point we will do the Industrial 3.0, which will be the first metal boat I show off. Uh, motor boat, metal boat. Uh, that one is an amazing boat if you want to live on a boat for your entire run on arc. Um, so look forward to that one. But yep, this is the Industrial Boat 22. Uh, please hit that like and subscribe button and see you guys in the next one.